Hello again, it's Steve Grizzetti, co-founder of MoviePicks.com and author of the MoviePicks.com Guide to Vegas Movie Studio Platinum. And here we are in part three of our eight-part series called Basic Training with Vegas Movie Studio Platinum. And here in part three, we've got our new project. We've added a little bit of media to our project. You can see it there in our project media panel. But we haven't added anything to the timeline yet. Now, a tool in Vegas Movie Studio Platinum that's often kind of forgotten, but I think it's a very powerful tool, is something called the Trimmer. And you can open a clip or an event in the trimmer by right clicking on the event either on the timeline or while it's still a clip in the project media panel you right click on it and select the option to open in the trimmer now the trimmer is kind of a, an area in between the project media panel and the timeline a place where you can as you would expect pre-trim your video now a lot of times it opens much smaller than it is here if if you can't really get a good look at it you can drag on the corners and drag on the bottom here and it will get as big or as small as you'd like. The trimmer, as you can see, serves as a preview of your clip, and you can play your clip like this. Uh, you can drag the playhead through the clip like this, or there's a nice feature here called Hover Scrub, where you can just kind of, and I'm not clicking anything on the mouse, just move the mouse over that little preview window, and you can kind of scrub through the entire clip and see what's there. So it's nice for previewing your video, but it also has some dynamic functions. Primarily, it can be used to pre-trim your videos before you add them to your timeline. That can come in handy, particularly if you've got a long video clip. Say this were five minutes long, 10 minutes long, and I only want a short segment of it, or there are many short segments in a longer clip, and I want to grab them out of there instead of putting it on the timeline and then trying to cut them out while they're on the timeline. Show you what I mean by that. So I've got kind of a, this is, a somewhat long video clip and I want to use this short segment here so I position my playhead right here where I'd like my cut to begin and then I can press I on the keyboard or open bracket I'm just gonna press I you can see that it moves a little start point there uh, we could also get to that same start point by clicking on the hamburger menu that's over here to the right of the playback controls and select set endpoint move the playhead a little bit further and then press either O for out or close bracket or once again go to the hamburger menu and set your out point now we've created a sub clip here or a shortened version of the longer clip I can drag that directly to the timeline and rather than getting my big long clip I'm only going to get this segment so you just drag from the highlighted portion of the timeline down here there it is just going to delete that I don't really want that on the timeline but if I'd like I can create many sub clips from this longer clip in advance of putting them on the timeline so if I've got a long where I just had the camera running for a long period of time and I want to take a lot of short segments from it I can create in advance little sub clips of it and I can do that by I'm going to right click on the media bins folder here in the project media panel and I'm going to create a sub bin this, I'm going to call it sub clips. That's where I'm going to keep my little clips from here. Now, once I've created a little highlighted segment on my timeline, a little region, I can go over here to the hamburger menu and select create sub clip. And I can name that whatever I want. I'll call it part one. Click OK. And now it is saved back here to the project media panel. I can do that again. Create another one here. I for in. O for out. Once again, I'm just going to create another sub clip. Call this one part two. And I for in. O for out. We'll create one last one here. And I'm going to close the trimmer here. And what I have done is I've taken my big long clip and I've made little clips out of it. So if I drag any of these short clips here to my timeline you notice I'm not getting my big long five minute long master clip what I'm getting are little sub clips so this can come in handy when you've got a long video and you want to just use parts of it you can pre-trim it you can pre-select its prime choice segments in advance of putting them on the timeline save you a lot of trouble save you a lot of complicated editing later on the trimmer is a tool definitely worth getting to know and it's launched simply with a right click.